Hello everyone, what it do, what it do? We are starting this vlog in the car and here I am again trying to adjust. <laughs> trying to adjust my camera so it don't fall. I still might have to hold it. Oh, sorry. My bad. But we are starting this vlog in the car. I am on my way to get my nails done because it looks a mess. Like... Bro, ladies, we should never let it get that far. But yeah, we're on our way to get our nails done. Uh, welcome to another weekly vlog. My name is Gosney. If this is your first time here, um, go ahead and click that subscribe button and the bell notification uh, so you can help your girl out. I realized on my last vlog, I did not do an intro or an outro. <sighs> Right, <laughs> so I'm trying to remember to, to say it now. So hi, how you guys doing? I hope all is well with ya. Um, but yeah, I hate carrying, um, holding my camera while I'm driving. So I will see you guys in the nail salon. I'm doing a very cute fall, um, fall look for my nails. I'm gonna show you guys. Um, the guy I go to is freaking amazing. He's expensive as hell. But I always go back because he literally knows what he's doing. But anyway, yes. So, that is one of the things that's on the agenda. Oh, my God. That is one of the things that's on the ad agenda today. And also, also say hi to my little friend. Uh -huh. Yep. Yep. So, that, that, that just happened. Woke up with a planet on my face. I named her. Her name is Becky. So say hi to Becky, y'all. Uh. But anyway, yeah, I'm not going to keep holding on to my camera. So I will see you guys in the nail salon. Bye. Ever since you found me, we the only thing I see Forever and a day, it's you and me And they can't replicate this unity No pressure, I can see I'm watching and they try to do better But you one in a million, you ain't average Girl, I promise I'ma have you living lavish Take a trip, girl, we're about to vanish Cause I'll go anywhere, anywhere Just as long as you with me Cause girl, I know that you get me so I'll go anywhere About the way they looking at us Cause I know they wish they had it And they know we doing damage to the game I don't care about the stereotype I can never do it mono We the stereotype I'm talking left, right, link I'm talking left hand ring I'm talking this right here forever We ain't here just for the summer Always on 10 We ain't never had to come up Young right now But we gon' watch the numbers run up Honestly, I love the way you carry it It was an easy decision I had to marry it Honeymoon, I'ma put you on a chariot And they don't make them like you no more No pressure Hey y'all So I am back um, I got my nails done Oh my gosh They couldn't come out more perfect Oh my gosh I am freaking obsessed Like my nail tech He's He's that neat He's that dude. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so I just got home. I am about to start dinner right now. It's currently um, 5.18. Um, I did prep my meat last night. I'm having turkey wings. And turkey wings normally take approximately an hour and a half, sometimes two hours to cook. So it's... 519, 567, five, so maybe approximately 730 I should be um, starting to eat. I went to Publix and I got me some quinoa. I'm trying to stay away from rice a little bit. Like, I'm a rice whore. I don't know if it's the Caribbean in me, but I am a rice whore. I love rice. There's just something about carbs, period. From pasta, bread, rice. Oh my 
gosh. And that's why I have a belly. I, oh, ooh, I love it. And I also went to the beauty supply store because I'm actually going to do my hair. New week, new hair. I'm going to be doing a ponytail, um, a braided ponytail. Yeah. And I also got some clips. And yeah, I kind of I kind of wanted to show you guys um, my cooking routine. Well, it's not technically a routine, but it's just like just me cooking. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, you probably don't. I love cooking. I really, really do. I think I think it's it's relaxing. And I just love when people eat my food and they're like, yo, this is bomb. This is, let me show you guys the turkey, the turkey wing. Oh, come on, Jesus. Yes. For all my Caribbeans out there, my Zoes, I got that it piece. Yes, ma'am. All right. So I'm glad I seasoned it last night because now all I got to do is pop it on the stove and then we're going to get and then we're going to start cooking. Let me clean up my area first a little bit. I really wanted to go to Aventura today, but I can't. I really tried. It's already 521. And then after I'm done eating, I'm gonna be, after I'm done cooking, I'm gonna eat. And then I have to go to my dad's house later on tonight. And then I have to do my hair. And then I also have to shoot a video. This is where, um, this is the pro of having insomnia. You can do a lot of things that you couldn't do during the day at night because you can't sleep anyway. So you might as well just keep busy until you fall asleep. So that's the pro. So I see myself after my dad's house, gonna come home, do my hair, put on some type of simple makeup for the camera, and then do my video. I'm not gonna start editing it, but at least I'm gonna film it. If I can't sleep, I will start, at least start editing until I get tired. Yep, my life as a introverted insomniac.
I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I think I messed up on the quinoa. I don't, I don't normally cook quinoa, but I don't think it's supposed to look like this. First and foremost, I put way too much peas and um, corn. I should have put half the can. I fucked up and put the whole can, like... Is this supposed to look like this? Like... Is it supposed to look like that? I don't, I'm not sure. I'm really trying to treat it like rice, but I, uh, I'm nervous. I'm nervous, I'm nervous, I'm nervous. However, though, my turkey looking bomb schmiggity. It looks really good. Yes. My turkey looks really good, but my quinoa is is questionable. As right now, I just have to let it cook, let it do its thing. But I am nervous. Oh my gosh, y'all! I was worried for no reason. This came out so perfect. Ah! Oh my goodness, it's so fluffy, and the corn and the peas I added was not. It, pfft, look what it did to the fork. <laughs> but the corn and the peas um, was not too much. It was actually perfect. I look like I look like Grandma Janet right now. I don't know who Grandma Janet is, but I look like her. Anyway, but that's okay. So I wanted to taste try um test taste test it in front of you. <laughs> First of all, this is my plate. First of all. You know your meat is good when the meat is already falling off the bone. That's how you know it's tender and succulent. I was worried for no reason. The quinoa came out so perfect. I just haven't tried it yet. Wow. Wow. This is amazing. Mmm. Oh, wow. 10 out of 10. 1 thing I do, something I always do when it comes to cooking, I add a lot of flavor in my meat. A whole lot of flavor. Like the salt is there. Like it's the seasonings there you know and when it comes to like my sides especially if i'm making rice or quinoa i only add salt and pepper but very minimal like if you had the quinoa by itself it might taste bland but together it just works perfectly because the chicken has so much flavor or in my case the turkey mm -hmm. Mm, the peas and corn, perfect. Mm, I did that. This is delicious, but I'm about to go eat. Oh, it's hot. I'm gonna go finish the um. I'm gonna go finish you season three while I eat this. So, do. <laughs> hey y'all, what's poppin'? Brand new whip just hopped in. <laughs> I am on my way to a Halloween party, and I, w I really want to show you guys my outfit. It's supposed to be Catwoman, but it's very—it's giving me very um, dominatrix vibes. very dominatrix vibe so let me show you so this is the headgear and this is my outfit Hold on. Ooh. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> oh yeah and i and it also comes of course with a tail <clears throat> i'm not gonna be wearing any stockings not on purpose. Um, I was I was debating whether or not I should attend. So 
I really didn't think, okay, I didn't buy stockings, okay? I didn't buy it. Um, it was a long work week. This is, um, today is Sunday and it is 11.07 p.m. Um, and we're going out. I live in Florida. We're going to Miami. So clubs don't, don't close until like four or six in the morning. Not that I'll be late. I'll be out that late. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But I want to have a good time tonight. It was a long, hard working week. And yeah, I'm going to have fun. Right now, what am I doing? Where's my mascara? I love that I have this face mask. Oh my goodness. I love that I have this face mask on because I don't have to do anything. I don't care for makeup right now. Where? Hold on. I need my mascara. I at least want to, you know, do something to my lashes. I'll be back. Where's my mascara? Okay, I think I left my mascara in the car. Ugh, whatever. I'll just use these. This is kind of making my face hot, though. I'm not going to lie. It's giving me real hot flashes right now. But at least I'm... Should I put... Oh, freak. I'm really thinking, should I put lashes? Will they vamp the look? I was looking at... um, I was looking at Catwoman. And she didn't really... She don't really do much. I was really looking at Halle Berry. I'm not going to lie. I was looking at Halle Berry, looking at what she wore back in the day with her real Catwoman cost, um, costume. It looked like she didn't really have anything on her eyes. And she had like a red bold lip. And like no jewelry. So I was thinking about doing the same thing. Or maybe am I just being lazy? Let's be honest here. Is it because I do not want to put on makeup? And of course, my red lipstick. This one is from NARS. I recently just got this one. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh, you cannot mess up with this because it will stink quick. I'm hoping I can pull this off without lip liner. I mean, if I need lip liner, I'll get lip liner, but... Hmm. I want lip liner. Sorry. I can't do it. I just don't think I look good with something like this. Okay, so my friend is calling me. I am picking her up. So I will talk to you guys later. I will be vlogging everything. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Okay. Look, they can never keep me down, I'm going And if I ever fail, just know I'll go again I never quit, cause I know that every loss May lead to another win, I'm going up I, I bet when I land, they gon' tell me it's luck again See that I'm winning, it's harder to watch I'm setting the stage, you should give me my prize You ain't got a soul, you lacking the spirit You talk out your neck, I'ma show you I'm with it I've been really happy you to sit and watch me win again And win again and win again I know it's probably getting on me and when I'm sending them So if I ever win again, it's nobody the minimum I didn't have to sell my soul oh, yeah. Please don't play no games with me It was never about the fame to me and needed the best, so they came to me. Whoa. Who the best in this thing? Tell them, yeah, that's me. Tell them, tell them who bring the vibe. Say, yeah, that's me. Who make it flip, make it bang. Ooh, yeah, that's me. Who make the party feel alive. Tell them, yeah, that's me. My girl's so proud of your boy when they ask you, is that your man? Yeah, that's me. And if I'm taking a shot, I don't miss. Who knew I would be at the top like this? And no one made my goals for me. But I'm exactly who I'm supposed to be. Cause it's the path that God chose for me. So even if some doors close for me, I still won't let y'all close to me So please step back where you supposed to be Put the game all on hold for me And sit back, watch me roast the beat uh, It's in my jeans, I'm better than I'm in I know my flow too sick, I got the medicine I'm way at the top, who can take my place? I went too hard, can't feel my face Who the best in this thing? Tell them, yeah, that's me Tell them, who bring the vibe? Say, yeah, that's me Who make it flip, make it bang? Ooh, yeah, that's me Who make the party feel alive? Tell them, yeah, that's me Whoa! Yeah yeah, that's me. Yeah, that's Who that chillin' at the top? Tell them, yeah, that's me. Yeah, yeah. Tell them, yeah, that's 
me Yeah, I'm chillin' at the top Ooh, yeah, that's me Oh, yeah, whoa Look, they can never keep me down, I'm going And if I ever fail, just know I'll go again I never quit, cause I know that every loss May lead to another win, I'm going up I bet when I land, they gon' tell me it's luck again See that I'm winning, it's harder to watch I'm setting the stage, you should give me my prize You ain't got no soul, you lacking the spirit You talk out your neck, I'ma show you I'm with it I've been really happy you to sit and watch me win again And win again and win again I know it's probably getting on me and when I'm sending them So if I ever win again, it's nobody the minimum I didn't have to sell my soul Oh, yeah, ooh, please don't play no games with me Yeah, I love it! Hey, get in there! Yeah! I have to win and pull out the cards Yeah, what card? Oh, the blue? Yo, take a picture, take a picture. I love it. Yeah. I can't take a picture of this. No, I'm not taking it with you, baby. Take a picture of this. No, you get in there. Oh, take a photo of me. Take a photo Yes. Yeah, are right, you ready? Yes. All right, let's do it. Take a photo. Three, two, one. Cheat. Oh. Yeah. Hey. Nice. He got the car, too. That is so He got the fucking car. Oh, my God, yes. <laughs> Y'all live. I love it. I love it. Oh, yes. Oh, wait, wait, what's 20 seconds ago? Uh -huh. 20 seconds. That's uh, Steve from Blue's Clues. Yeah. 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 Oh, cool. <laughs> you know you went to the house. He's the executive producer. Hey. Korean gangster. It's Korean gangster. You're the Korean gangster. Oh, I'm the enforcer, you know? Blue's Clues oh, and Squid Games. I love, I love your outfit. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Really the fact that you're Asian, it works. I can switch it out, too. Oh. The numbers wrong. I love it. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my goodness, it is such a gloomy day. Today is Tuesday. The last time I was vlogging was Saturday. I was in Miami for um, Halloween night. Despite what it looked like, things really didn't go as planned. It was like hour plus to get into clubs and a whole bunch of walking and I was in hills and uh, it was a lot going on that night uh, we ended up our night at um, Vixen's <sighs> yeah it was just four of us at Vixen's we ended our night there but yeah it started off pretty rocky but we ended it decent it wasn't like oh my gosh i had so much fun but no it was it was decent however yesterday monday i literally just slept all day because last week i worked like a freaking dog i did a double um barely slept um yeah barely slept i was hoping i could sleep sunday night but we went out for halloween so when Monday came and I didn't come I didn't come home until like seven in the morning. So when Monday came, I literally slept all day. I was over it. I was like, I'm not picking up my camera. I'm not doing nothing on YouTube. I'm not doing anything. I just need to rest. My body and my mind was physically over it and over me. Like, girl, what are you doing? It was over it. It was over me. So I needed that time to rest. So now it's Tuesday and I am currently going to get my hair done because I look a mess. I didn't feel like doing my hair. Um, I think my hair is long enough to, you know, to put it down. Maybe it might look like a, a mini bob. Let's see. Let's see. I'm sick of these ponytails. I'm, 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 I'm sick of them. I need to give, them, give it a rest. But <laughs> it's funny because I asked a girl can I bring my own hair products? And she was like, yeah, go ahead, try it out. But before I thought about it, I'm like, is that weird bringing your, your own um, hair products to the salon? Like, is that weird? Because I'm so fidgety. Like, I prefer what I use and what I only use, which is Olaplex. I don't care to use anything else. Um... I don't know. I'm like, is that is that ghetto? Is that ratchet? Like, oh. <laughs> but it's just like if I'm paying a makeup artist to do my face, I have this one foundation I like, so I, you know, I want to bring my own foundation. But I don't know. I I I ended up not not doing it. I ended up just keeping my things home. I'm like, I'm gonna let them do what they do, because every time I do go to the salon, but this is my first time visiting this salon. 
but every time I go to the salon, um, I never really get any bad, you know, my hair never feels like, like, my hair always feels good after I get out from the salon, so, um, and it's a Dominican salon, so let's see, I really don't, didn't feel like doing my hair, um, I also gotta fix my, my big toe, my nail broke off yesterday, I went to dinner, cause I didn't feel like cooking, uh -huh. My nail broke off. I need to go get that fixed, but I'm really debating whether or not I should just do a whole pedicure because the last time I got my nails done, I didn't need a pedicure, so I didn't do nothing to my feet. But now I'm wondering, should I just... Ooh, accident. Ooh! Ooh! Ooh. That car is totaled. Totaled. Capital T. Oh no, but yeah, so I'm really thinking, should I do a pedicure? Uh, uh, my toes look so bad, and it's not even my whole toe, it's just that big one toe, it looks disgusting, but um, yeah, so I guess that's what I had to say in the car. I am still struggling, as you can, as you guys can see, my hands right here trying to hold my camera, I am still struggling, um on how to properly put my camera in my car. I purchased something on Amazon. This is a, a car mount. I purchased it on Amazon, but it also came with like this foam, sticky foam. I'm supposed to stick it on my dash. This is this, blah, blah, blah. But I ripped the sticky thing off because I thought that's what it was, it was, that's what I was supposed to do. And when I did that, I just messed up the whole thing. So I had to go back on Amazon and order another sticky foam to put it on my dashboard and to make this stick and for it to like suction it. Something like that. I have the pieces together. I just, I just haven't figured it out how to properly put it together. Like the pieces are there. It's there. Um, so far, I don't even know how to break this because I haven't properly used it yet. But I would say it really holds my camera really, really well. Like it's sturdy. I just don't know. I'm still trying to figure out how to keep it on my dash. So when I turn, I'm driving on a bumpy road. My camera won't go anywhere. So, so yeah. So the sticky foam thing is supposed to be coming today. Around like two something from Amazon. Um, and yeah. So that's my little rant and what I did yesterday. So now I'm just driving. And I will see you guys in the salon. I look like Grandma Sandy. I look like Grandma Sandy. I don't know who Grandma Sandy is, but even if she existed, this is how she looked like. I just feel like I just wasted my time. My time and my money. Oh my God. Okay. I should have never went to a Dominican salon. No shade to Dominicans out there, but I could literally smell 
the heat in my hair. I can smell it. Like, it's just heat after heat after heat after heat. And I'm like, I have a perm. I don't, I'm not natural. You don't have to blow dry my hair, flat iron it, do all of that. My hair's already straight. Like, she was literally trying to get the itty bitty, like, new growth I have. You don't have to. You really don't. It's not even an inch of new growth. I don't have none of that. My scalp is burning. Oh my God. Damn it, is this illegal? I'm so frustrated right now. I don't even know if this shit is illegal. What am I doing? Okay, anyway. Oh, gotta put a seatbelt on. Anyway, my scalp is burning. I feel like my hair is fried. I, I just feel like I could have done a better job. I didn't even get a trim. I, I look like Grandma Sandy. At this point, I don't know if it's because my hair is just short, but I was going, going more for not this bouncy 2006 type of look. Like, what the fuck is this? That is not what I was going for. I wanted to just like straight and then a mini bump. This is bumpy bumpy. Like who bumps hair like this? I should have said something, but I was just over it. I'm like, this lady is frying my hair. I don't like it. She did some type of wave here. I'm... It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. It's my fault. Oh my God, my scalp is feeling so tender, y'all. It's feeling so tender. Now I'm gonna try to go home to see what I can do to my hair to fix something that... I'm frustrated. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see you guys. I don't know when I get home or something. Cause I'm, I'm, I'm just really frustrated right now. So.